Hello guys, in this video we will see how to download and install Fedora Linux 43 Workstation Edition on VMA Workstation. Okay, first go to first go to Fedora official website and download. It is Fedora Project dot wars. See here at the time of making this video, the latest release is 43. See, okay, then hover mouse on this get Fedora. See here we have the different editions: Workstation, KDE Plasma, Server, Cloud, Core OS, and IoT. Click on this workstation, then click on download or click on this download now to download the Fedora workstation 43. See here we have the for Intel and AMD x86 64 systems or for ARM ARC 64 systems. So download this ISO file. Click on this download button. See download started. Go to download. See here its size is about 2.6 gigabytes. And file name is Fedora Workstation Live x86 64 ISO file. Okay. I am cancelling this one because I have already downloaded Fedora Workstation 43 ISO image. Okay. In your case, wait until download completes. Once download is completed, then open VMA Workstation. Now click on create a new virtual machine or go to file and select new virtual machine. Both are same. Click on next. Then select the installer disk image file that is ISO file. Then click on browse. Then go to downloads. See here I have the Fedora Workstation Live ISO file. Select it. Then click on next. Now provide the name for the virtual machine. Name can be anything. This is just virtual machine name. Then select the location to store this virtual machine files and folders by clicking on this browse button then select the path area of the enough space to store this virtual machine files and folders click on ok click on next now we have to select the virtual hard disk size i am giving 50 gigabytes then click on next see this is the virtual machine hardware information if you want to customize click on customize hardware information i want to increase this memory to 4 gigabytes then click on close then don't select this power on this virtual machine after creation then click on finish still if you want to modify the settings of this virtual machine click on edit virtual machine settings or right click on select settings or go to vm and settings all three options are same and if you want to provide description click on here and provide the description then click on power on this virtual machine. Use up and down arrows and select the first one that is start Fedora Oxidation Live. Hit enter. See if cursor is grayed out, just press Alt Control to release the cursor. See if you want to use this for testing purpose or live purpose, you can use and you can shut down. But if you want to install permanently, click on this install Fedora Linux. Now select the language. See, by default it has selected my local language, so search for English, then go up, see here we have the United States, English United States, select it, then keyboard, I am going with the defaults, then click on next, see here, destination, see this is the default one, if you want some other, click on change destination, I, okay, I am ok with this one, so by default it has selected, use entire disk, then click on next, storage configuration if you want to encrypt data select this checkbox i don't want so click on next see this is the summary if you are okay with all the settings then you have to click on erase and install but if you want to modify any one of these settings click on this back okay so i'm okay with these settings then click on erase data and install see installation has been started this will take time i'm going to pause this video and then it will ask us to reboot the system then we will reboot the system and we will perform the post installation steps in the meantime, please subscribe my channel for more tutorials. See successfully installed. To begin using Fedora Lynx 43 Workstation Edition, reboot your system. So click on Exit Live System. Now right click on this one, then Power, then select the Restart Guest. Select Restart. Now we have to configure. So English is fine, then click on Next typing i am going with the defaults click on next you want to enable local services and automatic problematic report you have to keep this as it is if you want to turn off turn off like this then click on next now select the time zone you can search city here or you can select on the globe 
then click on next if you want to enable third party repositories enable then click on next now we have to create our setup user here we have to provide user full name then below is the username then click on next now set the password for this user then click on next all done click on start using fedora linux skip then open terminal see here these are the default applications that comes with fedora linux 43 workstation click on this terminal let me increase the font size see font size has been increased now verify the version more slash etc os hyphen release see we have installed fedora linux workstation 43 release type is stable okay now verify the ip of the mission if config see this is the ip of the mission okay control it the first step after connecting to fedora linux 43 is we have to update the packages sudo dnf update percent percent sudo dnf upgrade hit enter then provide the password of the currently logged in user that is soap user or sudo user see it is going to install 8 packages upgrading 278 packages and replacing 279 packages type a for confirmation and hit enter see it is downloading okay this will take time okay so in this video we have seen how to download and install Fedora Linux 43 workstation edition on Vmware workstation. Okay, for more tutorials, please subscribe my channel. Thank you.